It is Holy Week. We are here just outside Ruby. And well, it's been a busy old week this week. We've crammed a lot in between Flanders and Ruby. It's Thursday, so that means it's recon day for the teams. The professionals are all out testing themselves on the circuit, refreshing their memories. And well, there's also a few chumps out. This being one of them, testing themselves on the roads that are going to be uh, battled upon this coming Sunday. We're literally having the time of life. <laughs> Best day <laughs> ever. So this is this is why they're, they're not within any classics because can kids and joggers can keep up. Tack. Go on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chopped him up as well. That's awesome. Oh, pull the brakes on. <laughs> <laughs> Lean out, don't let that happen. <laughs> and we are off. We've got a couple of champions on board today. Um, a previous world champ and a current Belgian champ. We'll be catching up with them at some point, getting their take on the new bike, getting their take on how technology's changed. Because the one who used to be a world champ and Belgian champ and Roubaix winner and Flanders winner did ride a suspension bike back in the 90s. When you were racing, you rode on a Bianchi, that was ahead of its time and that had suspension, front and rear suspension. And my generation was a little bit different. The bike was coming over two days before, two days before Robert. And I have riding on the cobbles with it and it was really comfort. But oh, just on the cobbles, I have suspension in the front, the shock rock and in the middle also the bike. So a lot of movement, it was a lot more more dancing on the bike and All right, guys, nobody seconds. was thinking you will lose what no everybody talking about what 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 yeah. and yeah, uh, after 200 mm -hmm. I was really over so I have spent too much effort which meal was in the breakaway I was behind in sec seconds and I can't reach him so I can't say it, it was the bike but it was the bike <laughs> warm for form <laughs> this is the madness that is getting ready for a group ride with a bunch of journalists. Raising, lowering saddles, changing handlebar whips, tyre pressures. How long have we been shooting here for, Kaylee? Oh, I don't know. 45 minutes. <laughs> See, the things we go through to uh, the cold, we wear. We're having fun. All the cameras. All the gear, no idea. <laughs> There's not many sports where, after bashing round a velodrome, or finishing the sporting event, you get excited about using a shower, even if it's a cold shower. Behind these doors, many men have cried, some with tears of joy, others with oh, disappointment and sorrow. Anybody named Pete? <laughs> I've got to go for Tom, haven't I? Who else have we got? Jan Rass, Peter Post. It's supposed to be cold, it's the legend truth. It's hot, what's going on? It's all lies. What we've been told through the years is all lies. It's hot. Uh, the pros aren't tough. They've got soft bikes that take out all the bumps. They've got hot water. The pros today, they don't know how good they've got it. I don't think I've been in a situation before where Men uh, showing each other photos of themselves nude in the shower and going, Do you want me to send you this? Ruby, it throws up everything. <laughs> Should I put this up on my um, grinder account? That's the one. That's 
the sound of Belgium. Outside some nondescript industrial estate building. There's no sign on the doors above the building, but there is a massive clue to where we are with the vehicles that are parked out the front. We are at the Trek Sega Fredo service course. We're going to see what goes on into supplying a team with all the equipment, running a team, and uh, basically getting ready for the classics. Ah, oh, hey guys, come on in. Hold on, the guys, you've got team pajamas. Oh, yeah. Those are the most comfortable pajama pants that you'll ever wear. And we'll set you guys up with some pajama pants. So. Right, just wait till we get back to the hotel. Me and Kaylee will, will model for everybody. So, this is um, Mir's the, the women's clothing room. We um, have a few more men's riders, but still the same shipping uh, situation where each rider has their box. If a rider needs something, shoes, clothing, we put it in their box and then when the truck comes in for the race, it gets loaded up, off it goes to the rider. So this oh. is where everyone gets breakfast, is it? How often is this restocked then? You know, is this a season's worth of food? Um, so basically, this is the overstock and everything on the trucks, the trucks are full. Probably, we get about four drops a year. Of. Oh, uh, we're, we're, we need a drop soon. Yeah, you need yeah. a drop soon. Yep, we're getting a little bit low. Okay, so we've got some cakes here. It's not it's, just all energy food. Right so we work with a bakery, a local bakery, to make different uh, rice cakes that, you know, these get cut up. But the local bakery works with our uh, nutritionists to um, uh, make those in a way that they're healthier for the riders. Well, there's only one drink to have when you're at the uh, Trek Sega Fredo. Trek service course at by the numbers. I'm not going to remember all these, so I've uh, wrote them down. 120 wheels for the classics in total. There's 50 on the truck and 70 floating around in team cars. And for the race, team cars, VIP cars, in total, there is 18. Right? Bikes wise, everybody gets five a year. There is a, a few here and there added extra in case there's crashes. Spare frames hanging up, there's five of each model in each size. Tires, are you ready? 1500 tires a year, spare and used. Bottles, you're sitting comfortably. 70,000 bottles a year, that means there's 70,000 happy people at the roadside grabbing bottles. 50% of them, old women who have knocked small children out the way. Right. Gels to keep them fueled, 50,000. There is 10 to 15 kits each a year, just race kits. On top of that, they've got kits that they'll use at home. Finally, well, copious, copious amounts of coffee. So who who do you want to see today? What riders? Van Aert. Today's job is to get basically a bit of tech. Yep. And do Facebook Live, not Facebook Live. That's for the old people, isn't it? <laughs> Instagram Live. Where all the kids are. Where all the kids are. Uh, from the recon. We've just done Instagram Live, so let's get all the bike bits now. Waiting for the pros to hopefully clamber off the buses. Oh, Sunweber coming, I think. We better get should we work. Go over that bus? The atmosphere here on recon day, well, there's two recon days, Thursday and Friday, is, well, not electric, but it's good fun. It's real family wholesome fun, shall we say. There's a huge crowd down here where all the riders usually roll up. So first team's through in about half an hour, aren't they? Just about. Yeah, we're, uh, we're just waiting. That's, just, that's, that's all we can do at this point. But we are, when they get here, we're going to chat with some of them and ask them about how it went and how they feel about Sunday. All right, we'll have a, we'll have a sandwich before then. I, I need a sandwich pretty soon. We're getting the meat sweats on. We found a good cafe in France and they've given us that to wear. We all look like Indiana Jones or um, everybody looks like Indiana Jones. Or gardeners. Someone asked me to lick a cobble and I said that I would only do it if he joined Vela Club. 
and then I licked a cobble, and so he joined Velo Club. We now have one more Velo Club member, and all I had to do was lick the ground. I'd do it again. Check Phil out is <coughs> very good video guy. In fact, he's outstanding in his field. Ale, ale, ale. Ale. Venga, venga. Come on. You <laughs> mug <laughs> It's absolutely fun. <laughs> <laughs> Getting ready to get shots for the weekend. We're gonna. Well, Phil's here, so we're getting actually good footage. <laughs> uh, Dave, your footage is great. It just lives up to my name, doesn't do it? Great, you do great footage. The footage is brilliant. Look how much crap I'm carrying with me. <laughs> We've come to Roubaix Velodrome and we struck lucky. You'd think we would have planned it. We managed to get Sagan's bike. So by the time this is up, there should be um, a Sagan bike feature. What do you reckon, Kayleigh? Phil? Yeah. Phil doesn't talk. He, he's feature. a mute. Uh, we're going to go up to Quick Step. Are we? So they've come to the quick step. No, the Koinic press conference. It's fun, isn't it? Koinic. It's fun. Yeah, press conference is a bag. Well, big bags of fun. Everybody, everybody on stage looks slightly like they wish they weren't here. Yeah, like literally everyone in that room looks like they want to take a nap. Now, this isn't really the talking, fault of talking, it. talking about napping and cut to video. And we're back. <laughs> I think that was on the way here. That was on the way here. Yeah, so it's, you know, the, the whole the way out here as well. Every, everyone's <laughs> feeling that way right now. So we're drinking coffee and taking in the vibe. Making the most of the uh, freebies. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, eh, man? Mind your knackers. <laughs> oh, that's that's brave, Kaylee. Even that way, you're, not, you're telling us. You've got kids yet? How's this, huh? That's one hell of an Airbnb. I'm Catholic. Are you? The only time I've been to church in the past 30 years was to do some brass rubbings at primary school. <laughs> you know you're in Belgium when? Uh, you've got the Ronde. On the front cover. On the front, putt, front page. And you're in a bakery full of delicious looking things. Like Phil is delicious, isn't he? Hmm? Phil, while Kaylee's on the phone, explain, explain away. Race car driver, Kaylee Fretz. <laughs> May have had a slight blowout on the motorway. <clears throat> Could it be anything to do with cobbles yesterday? Possibly. <laughs> uh, looks like we're not going to make it to testing a suspension road bike today. I mean, yeah, it exploded while we were in the left lane going about 100, the speed limit. My, my, my father was a professional. Yeah? yeah. What team? Ooh. But that's many years ago. Yeah? Yeah. The same time of Arthur de 